In this video, let us see how we can make manpower histogram from P6 to Excel. This is the sample schedule that we will be using now. Go to Projects tab and click on Resource Assignments. Here in this window, right click and select Group and Sort by and click on Customize. In the Group by, select the resource names. Select the first option to show grand totals and set the other options as per your requirement like this and click OK. Now you can see the group and sort by applied. Click Ctrl A and select all. Copy all. Go to some blank Excel sheet. Paste the P6 data here. It will be like this now. Now select the first two rows. Copy and paste it to another sheet. You can link this sheet with the first sheet as well for future easy updating. Now select the date fields along the top totals. From the menu bar, go to insert ribbon and in the charts group, select the 2D cluster column chart. Your budget units graph will look like this. Adjust the formatting of this graph to make it more presentable. If you want to have the manpower histogram, add a row under the budgeted units and enter the formula like this in L5 as equals to L4 divided by in the parenthesis 9 multiplied by 5 close the parenthesis because a week will have 5 working days as per our calendar and 9 work hours a day. So this call, this row is the manpower count. Apply this formula to all the weak cells till last column. Now similarly, generate the line graph with this manpower row. This will be the final output of manpower counts by week wise in a histogram view. Now every week with the update in P6 schedule, you can paste the resource assignments dump into this first sheet and you can see the updated graph here for presentation. Got it friends? It is very simple and awesome, right? So in this way you can make man for histogram from P6 to Excel. I hope you have enjoyed this, enjoyed this tutorial. If yes, please give me a like, share and comment. For further more interesting videos, please do subscribe to tutorials. Thank you friends. Thanks for